Hi everyone, I want to show you how to use your Google Drive photos and any other Google Drive files inside of your WordPress media library. So usually you would go to media and add your media or on a post or a page or a custom post you would upload your images and files that way. But if you have them in Google Drive already, it's much easier just to import them that way and directly from there. So you can do that. You go to plugins, add new, because you're going to need a plugin for this. And search for external media. And then you'll install this first one here. And then activate it. And then go to its settings. You'll also find it under settings, external media. And as you can see, uh, it gives you other options as well, such as Dropbox, Box, OneDrive, Instagram, and then in this case, Google Drive. So just say enable this plugin, leave this unchecked. Gives you some basic instructions here. Just click on this link. So you can go to the Google Developers Console. And you can use an existing project or you can create a new project. And basically what you want to do is use the Google API and get a client and application ID uh, to authenticate with. So as you can see, it's still loading. Go to credentials. What you want to do is the default screen that shows is the normal API key and you're not going to use that so what you want to do is do create credentials and choose OAuth client ID. Configure consent screen just fill in all your details you can upload you can uh, choose your logo, policy, terms, etc. And then save it. Choose web application. Uh, and for the redirect URL, you want to go back to the plugin settings. And you'll see way down here, there is a URL. Just copy that, it says redirect URL and paste that into this field and say create. So you're going to create the client. Copy the client ID. You won't actually be using this secret. So you paste the client ID in here and then the application ID as it says is the first number in your client ID. So just paste that as well and remove the port up to this dash so you just get this first number in there then you can choose what types of documents you want to show photos documents drawings folders etc best is to untick the filter because otherwise it's just going to show stored items you have the option to show only files owned by yourself and then this gives you a better view with the folders and then save changes let's just go back here and make sure that the API is enabled enable the API Enable the Drive API and you should be set to start importing your Google Drive media. So 
create a new post or a page or go to the media library and say testing So what you do is you click on the regular add media button in WordPress and you'll see under the upload files tab there is a new button named import from Google Drive and as you saw before there were uh, Dropbox there were other services like Dropbox Box OneDrive Instagram etc if you enable those the uh, the plugin will add additional buttons in this area so let's say import from Google Drive it's going to open a pop up and basically you're going to now sign in with your Google account and create an OAuth uh, with the plugin, with the app that you created in the API. Say allow and that's it. You will now see all of your Google Drive folders and you can search for files. So let's um, search for something here. I'll go to images. This is really fantastic. I mean, I use Google Drive for pretty much everything. And being able to access all of that from inside of WordPress is great. So let's um, let me choose an image here. A logo. Let's take this and say you can actually select multiple items as well. So say select, and that's all there is to it and it imports into your WordPress media library and that's it thank you for watching and enjoy I hope you found it useful